All right, I just received this in the mail. It's an endoscope, and it says it works with um, my iPhone, so we're gonna try it out. Let's go ahead and unbox it, see what's inside. So here we have it, and apparently it is. So we're gonna have to download an app, and this works off of Wi-Fi, and it has a standard USB plug, and it has that little plug that you use for charging. You can see, it, it, see how she works, but the iPhone has a different setting to plug it into. But apparently you plug it into this, and then this hooks up to, via Wi-Fi to your phone. So we'll see here. You may have to read a little bit on it. But let's take a look and see what it comes with. Here we have different type of head. So you've got a, uh, you got a little hook that you can grab something with. You've got a little mirror that you can see it with. And then you've got um, a magnet. So you get the mirror, the magnet, and the hook. And... Um, and then this little piece here, which I think is what clamps those down. So let's save those, put those in back in here. So we don't, well, we may have to put them in a certain way, I guess. So we can get them all in. Well, apparently that's good. Let's just put them here, because <laughs> that's just not working. There's a warranty card in it, and you get a little bag. I'm gonna have to pull these out, set them to the side here. And then this is your bag that it comes with to put it in. And then you have a scope, like a, this is like a selfie stick, basically. So I don't know if we're gonna use that. And you do get a lot of, uh, there's where you hook up all your stuff to. And I, and I do believe there's a light to it. So I think we have to charge it first. So let's do that. So apparently we've got, yeah, okay. So we're gonna plug it in here. We have to charge it first, right? So we're gonna go ahead and plug it in there. And then we have to plug this into a block and we plug it into the wall. Use one of my iPhone blocks We'll just hook it in there and we're just gonna plug this in and uh, let it charge. Okay, so we just plug her in here and it's not very long code. <laughs> and then we just gotta let that charge. And while that's charging, we're gonna read the directions. <laughs> How's that sound? It does come with this extendable wand. And uh, as you can see, it does extend pretty far, <laughs> look. <laughs> All right, on the end of it, you have these little attachments that I do believe you put your hose in there. So I believe it goes, you know, like this so that you can push this, you know, higher, you know, farther up if you're trying to get some video of something above you. And it just comes out really easy. And they give you a couple extra of these clips so you can use them. So that's good. And uh, then this is telescoping. And you just kind of slide it back in like that. And then it shrinks up to a little itty bitty, uh, you know, six inch deal. So that's pretty cool. So you will have to download this app if you're using iPhone. All right, so while we're waiting for it to charge, let's go ahead and go to the App Store and uh, let's get that application. So I'm gonna search for INSKM. I-N-S-K-M. Hopefully this doesn't have a bunch of uh, stuff from China that's going to invade my phone. <laughs> Oops, I spelled it wrong. All right, let's see. All right, so there it is. I do believe I-N-S-K-M. Wi-Fi endoscope. Utilities. There's a whole bunch of them in here. But I think that this is the one we want. So let's go ahead and get that. All right, so there we are. We got it open. And Inga would like to find and connect to devices on your network. Okay. Allow access to local network in settings of ISCM. Okay. All right, so now I got to do that. <clears throat> okay, so now we just have to uh, let's open up the app. 
Photo and video, please connect the device. All right, we have to wait for the device to uh, <laughs> to um, charge, so that's gonna be a while. As you can see, we still got a red light here. It's still charging. That's the power button there, by the way. And uh, as soon as we get this thing working, we'll give it a shot. See how it, see how it does. So it does come with a pretty good amount of line here, or I don't know what you call it, cable, fiber optic cable, I would imagine. And these are always a pain in the butt to get off. But yeah, it's definitely, I mean, slinky, slinky. There's a lot of it. There we go, look at all. So this is the end that, that we hook up. And uh, if you look right here, there's threads. So to put, let's say, here's the one with the mirror, right? So to put that on, what you're going to do is just put it on there. And then you just kind of turn it. You just got to make sure you don't cross thread it. because You don't want to screw it up, right? And of course, this thing does not want to go on there. I think that's it. Bam, done. Get it off. Counterclockwise, done. And if you look, you can see it's got little grooves in it, little grooves there. So this should just, just go right on there. I mean, that's it. <laughs> I mean, it should be a little bit better than that. So let's take that off. So anyway, and then this, I guess you could just feed this straight down there and it has just this little connector here like this. So if you wanna just put it in just to see, you're like you're not trying to do anything, well, that one goes on good. Look at that, son of a gun. That fit on there perfect. So we're probably just gonna use this because we're, I'm gonna go down the drain to look and see what the heck's going on down there. And so this is a camera and a light, there's light. So we'll be able to see. And then this plugs in to the USB on the device itself. So you have two plugs on the device, which I'll show you right now. There's the USB there, and then there's this one here for the charging. So that's the charging, and that's for the connection to see what's going on. And then that's where you put um, your USB here. Bam. Done. And we're going to do that a little bit later, as soon as that charges up. All right, so let's take a look. It looks like it may be charged. So let's go ahead and unplug her. Bring her over here. We'll set her down. All right, so slide it over. So now, what we're going to do, we're going to go ahead and plug this in, right? Okay, that's, that's that, that's on. Now what we have to do, to, we've got to turn it on by pressing this. Bam, turns on, right? All right, now we have to see if the, if the phone sees it. So let's go in here and... Um, Let's open up our app. Say, please connect to the device. Okay. Allow access. Okay. All right, no data. Camera. All right, so you have to go into settings and go to Wi-Fi. I know you're going to think it's Bluetooth, but it's not. You got to go to Wi-Fi. And this is going to be a Wi-Fi uh, connection, actually. <laughs> All right, so it's not finding it there. Let's go to, let's go to here, Wi-Fi. Let's see if it shows. Oh, look, here it is right here. Let's connect it. All right, so now we're connected to it, okay? So, bam. Now, we should be able to go back to our app. Oh, no internet connection. Well, let's see what the deal is. Unsecured network, open networks provided secure. Auto join. Huh. So I'm having a problem here. So what is the deal with this? So operation gate, long press, three seconds, click icon, interface with smartphone, and then click Wi-Fi on your smartphone. Name the Wi-Fi ISCOM, click it to connect the, di the dental camera. Please check the battery. Oh, it's just not, it's not showing it. Let's try it again. Let's go to info.
So it's just not, it's not allowing us to get in on it. Let's turn it off. Let's turn it on. Give it another shot. There it is. Unsecure network. Okay, so now it's connected. So now we can go back. Oh, no energy. So this is not working. <laughs> you know? I mean, that's a very disheartening. I was really excited to see if it would work. Let's see. Let's just go in here and let's see what's going on here. All right, so now when I click on the app, it actually uh, will open up. And apparently that's how you connect it. And this is a tutorial, so don't get lost in here. You've got to get out of this, and I will in a minute. Oh, so it's working. See? Look. <laughs> so I'm, look, I can see myself. Hi, self. Okay, so that's that. All right, so now it's working. Okay, once you click on uh, Connect, it opens up to this page, which is, as I said before, it's going to teach you how to use this thing. And you can't do anything here. You touch everything and nothing nothing moves. So what you've got to do is you've got to get out of it, and then you can do all these different little maneuvers. Uh, it's telling you what they are on the side. And, um, you know, if you click on them like I just did there, nothing happens. Okay? So what you got to do is you got to go up to the top, and uh, you got to go ahead and click out of this so you get into the actual application of uh, uh, of this app. So it's showing jump over. Okay, it's that's what it was. It was trying to give me a tutorial. So now we're good. Now we can go look. So what we're going to do is we're going to go in the back and we're going to see what we can see in our our sink. How's that sound? So let me just put that right there. So I'm going to go ahead and feed this in there and see if we can see anything. And um, you can see it here. And there we go. We're looking in there. Okay, that's cool. So now what I want to do is I want to get to the side here and look back there. So you can see back there is that spring. But so it doesn't look like I've got... There we go. I don't have any blockage there. You see that? Let's see if I can get farther in there. This is kind of tricky to get out of here, by the way, too. So what I got to do is I got to pull it and then pull this thing out of there. Like that. All right, so I got that out of there. <laughs> we'll set that to the side. Now we can fish this down in there and see what the hell is blocking the, uh, the drain. So we're just going to go ahead and, first of all, I'm going to bend it. And set that right there. So here we go. See? Now we can just fish it down there. Let's go a little bit deeper. I mean, look. I don't see anything in there that's blocking it. Of course, you know, it's, it's, what it's doing is it's rubbing against the, let me twist it a little bit. So if I turn it, let's go deeper and then I'll turn it. Mm. That's a problem, you know, because you, you're going down in there and it's hard to see. So I want to get it. In and then bend it a little bit. Okay, there, look. So there's where the water comes in, right? So now I got to get down a little bit farther and see if there's a, if there's something plugged in there. So I want to get around here. Yeah, there we go. So there's nothing there either. I don't see anything plugging it there. All right, as you can see that this little endoscope works pretty darn good. And uh, basically I was looking for a uh, plug, you know, something that was stopping the water from flowing down. 
and I got pretty deep in there and I couldn't find it. But this thing worked really well and I think it's a pretty good <laughs> it's a pretty good tool for the price. If you like this video, subscribe to my channel and check out my other awesome videos. Peace out.